Hi there, it's me Danish. Today we are going to discuss about what are the different types of valves using in oil and gas petrochemical industry. First of all, what is a valve? Valve is a device to control a fluid. It may control either isolation. Isolation means it's open or closed. Maybe it's controlling the pressure. It's maybe controlling for the flow. Controlling for the safety device means uh, to controlling the excess pressure and it may control for one direction flow. This is all the purpose using the valve. Now we can take a look for different purpose of the valves. First, isolation purpose. Isolation means the valve will be either two condition. It will be fully open or fully closed. So that means it will be allow the fluid to passing through in full throat. Otherwise, it will be closed completely it will not allow any flow so this is the isolation valves the purpose of the isolation valves examples of these valves gate valves ball valves needle valves etc there's there are many types of valves but this, we are explaining here only some important items so this is a isolation types valve the second is controlling the pressure or flow because sometimes we need to regulate the flow. We need to uh, take only particular uh, capacity, particular amount of uh, fluid through these uh, valves. In this case, we'll be use the control valve. The control valves for the controlling the pressure. These are globe valve, butterfly valve. These are the. This will be allow the partial flow. So these are the flow and pressure controlling valves, globe valve and the butterfly valve. Third is controlling on direction. This kind of valves will be allow the fluid passing only one direction. It will not allow for the reverse direction. Examples, check valves, this usually saying as non-return valves, as the name indicates, it is not return, only one direction. There are uh, many types of check valves, is the flapper types, ball types and dual plate types. Fourth one is safety or relief valve. The main purpose of this kind of valve to protect the system from the excess pressure. For example, on line has been designed for 20 bar pressure. If it is exceeding the pressure of 22 or 25 bar, there is a chance for damaging the piping system, also the equipment, all the instruments. So if we need to protect the system from the over pressure, we will be installed on PSV or PRV. So once it is reaching above the 20 bar, the PSV or PRV has been set on the spring, it has been compressed corresponding to 20 bar. Once it is reaching more than 20 bar, the spring will be compressed more. So there is a chance to open the uh, valve and it will be passed the flow through this PSV. So, so the excess pressure will be uh, passed through this PSV and the system will be protected. So this is the purpose of uh, safety or relief valve. This is a PSV, pressure safety valve and PRV, pr pressure relief valve. Okay, now we can take a look for a gate valve. So these are the outer parts is called as valve body and this portion is called as bonnet bonnet and this area is called as valve seat this is valve disc disc is coming in between the seat so it will be close to restrict the flow this is a bonnet packing here is a valve gland packing this is a spindle and this is a hand wheel. These are the major parts of a gate valve. When you are considering a gate valve, you have to be verify and identify the type of materials using for the valve, maybe carbon steel or stainless steel or alloy steel and type of flange rating 150 class 150 class 300 whatever it is, size rating and the seat material valve seat what is the material the valve disc what is the materials and how is the uh, handle is a handle type or wheel type so all the things this kind of things we must be verify prior to consider and check it or install it, get valve now we can take a look for what are the testing method of a valve there are three stages for testing the valve first one is high pressure shell test for the shell test, the valve will be in open condition and we will be isolate both sides of the valve. For example, this is a symbol of gate valve. We will be open this valve, open and we will be apply 
pressure in wash site with 1.5 times of design pressure for example the design pressure is 20 bar we will be applying 30 bar pressure in this area the total area but the valve will be in open condition this is a shell test second test is high pressure closure test in this case valve will be open sorry closed and we will be applying the pressure only on one side with 1.3 times of design pressure it is backseat test for the backseat test usually we are doing by the nitrogen but in the case of shell and high pressure closure test we will do by the hydrostatic test in the case of backseat test we will be close and we will be do the opposite side of the valve and we will be verify the air bubbles quantity so these are the three stages for testing a valve okay now we can take a look for what are the valve symbols using in p and ad and isometric drawings symbolically these valves are identified this gate valve this globe valve this wall and this plate valve this butterfly this nrv or check valve this is a psv or prv this is a control valve and this is a three-way valve there are uh, more than 100 types of valve, different types of valves and we are not able to explain all the valves here i hope you guys enjoy the video so please don't wait for like share and subscribe do it right now and thank you for watching have a nice day bye bye